have the means to locate the second Hell Priest. Your Celestial Locator is missing a component. We will need a replacement. I've completed the redesign of your equipment launcher. The Flame Belch is now ready for your approval. Hello again, Carlos here, and welcome back to another Doom Eternal. So, where we last left off, we've cut off the head of the Hell Priest, one of them, and we made it to this area known as the Fortress of Doom, my hub, where I do my spare times and all that. And I don't know about this, but it kind of reminds me a lot like, a lot like the Watchtower from Justice League. I don't know if it takes place in the same universe in DC and all that. Kinda, because I'm sort of like a superhero or something. Alright, enough said. We found ourselves our flame belch that's ready. Now, this thing is able to use a flamethrower on my shoulder. And it shows that I can sh get armor from them, so if I shoot them, I get enough uh, armor. The more enemy I flame, the more armor. And just to show it. Already done. And I am not certain, but I don't think I can go through this area. At least not yet. Locked. And let me just go check in this thing. We're looking artifact thingy. Which is the sentinel crystal. To so basically it's just a lot like the um, Argent energy thing to upgrade my suit. This is very similar. And based on what I'm trying to pick, I'm gonna go have to... I'm gonna have to choose the armor because I'm already low that. Uh, this will do. There we go, for now. Because I don't have any of my armor fixed. And this is the Sentinel Crystal that helps me upgrade my stuff. Alright, so let's go into this area known as Exultia. But first, let's go into this ARC audio. See what that's about. This is an ARC broadcast. There are reports coming out of the quarantined Hellified Zone near the San Andreas Chasm. Satellite imagery show what ARC personnel believe to be the legendary Doomslayer himself fighting the mortally challenged. The Doomslayer, or Doom Guy, as he is sometimes referred to, was thought to be a myth of the Resistance, a sort of avenging angel. He was last reported to be seen on Mars, and is allegedly responsible for the destruction of the Argent Tower there. He disappeared soon afterwards. The UAC continues to deny all reports of his existence. We will continue to broadcast new information as we receive it. Another thing I want to point out is that I'm not certain it takes place... Uh, feels like it doesn't take place after the event of the 2016, but somehow takes place in the previous games instead. Perhaps I'm just missing something. But enough said, let's go to the next area. And get this... whatever I'm trying to find. And this is beginning to look a lot like Stargate around here. So let's go. Alright, so we made it next to that area that we're supposed to go. Actually, we're in another dimension. And we're gonna have to go find this sentinel thing, whatever, to find, to activate our ship. And over here in the, in the upper right is the demonic corruption based on this area, location, or map. 
I'm saying the same thing over. Ooh, look what we have here. This giant mech thing trying to kill this Kaiju thing. Kaiju. Kaiju, what I'm saying. Oh yes, I almost forgot. Make sure you give a thumbs up. If there's anything you like, comment put down below and subscribe. And make sure you press the notification bell for any notifi notified things. I kind of forgot about that. Also, I just wanted to point out at that thing, which is a fun fact that I try to mention, that one of the um, developer of this game was also the art director or whatever for the movie Pacific Rims. Just a little fun fact. And there's something over there below. The secret's found, which is a one up. Ooh, almost dropped out. And there's something over there, something green. Oh, hi, doggy. Tommy Wasai will say, or whatever his name is. And I almost forgot to tell you that I've already had the um, classic pose for my weapon in over here. <clears throat> I just activated it and all. And we got ourselves a little Skyrim environment. This is a Bethesda game after all. And we found this, another one. Exultia. Let's see what it's this about. Lugaris again Tai Book of Kings. Let's see the image. Looks very nice. Almost a lot like Oblivion. And I'm beginning to feel that there's more of combat in our area, which I am right. We got a new enemy, Gargoyle. took care of something. Oh yeah, and there's um, Hell Knight. There we go. Just stop right here and you find another secret. Even I already know that. But I am already out of gasoline for my chainsaw. Another dog or a wolf and this thing. Which I believe is the blood punch. Looks like a giant glove. I'll take it. Blood punch. Okay, so I'm gonna have to perform two glory kill in order to unlock the blood punch. So let's try to see how that looks. Pretty badass. Now let's give this a go. Give this a go. Wow. And just to be sure if I miss anything, there's something over there, so I'm good. But there's another lot. Also, I forgot about this distracting me. There's another one up, I'm trying to say. 
and whatever this is. I thought I already did that blood punch. I guess I didn't do it well. Okay, so basically whenever you hear the this weird ominous chorus, that means I activated the blood punch. And whatever this thing is I found, it's a rune. Okay, so it looks like I'm gonna have to unlock one of these bad boys. Now which one I should get? Catalog, let's see. Blood fuel. Speed up the the glory kill. Perform faster. That's the booth. Boost. Much further, far away distance. Let me see. Staggered an enemy longer. Survive a death blow for a few moments before dying. I don't know what. Enemy killed by a shock drove, alright. Oh, this could be nice. Slow motion when I'm in the air. I'm just gonna go with this for now. Saving throws. Alright, looks like I got to unlock it. So, unlocking it is. And that looks like it's already done. I can unequip it whenever I want. Hold up. Did I do it or not? I'm not certain. I guess I did, okay. I'm just gonna have to find out to see. Let me just swing up here to uh, see if I can find that. There it is. Another secret, which is another life. And there's something down there. Yet another secret. Oh, that it's pretty simple. Another secret and a toy arachna tron or arachna troid toy. Speaking of which, in my last previous video of 2016, I mentioned that the arachna tron looked arachna, arachna tron. What am I saying? The Spider Mastermind look very similar to Krang from the Ninja Turtles. Not because of the because of the metallic leg, the robotic leg. In this one, it's more cybernetic, very similar, and all that. I'm getting ahead of myself because I'm just trying to take care of things. There's a Hell Knight. I try to perform this guy.
Almost dead. And look, there's a little blue orb from the classic game. Let me just get these first. Messed up in that. And there we go. All right, just to circle around, just to be there, just in case there's anything else. And doesn't seem like it, so let's go. More of these gargoyles circling or Speaking of gargoyles. There's a few right here. Say, uh... Thank you. How can I miss that spot? Wait, I just used a flamethrower. How's that possible? Oh, great. I'm dead. It's a lot. I also forgot that I still have that blood punch. That could have been useful. Alright, that takes care of that. Even though I lost life. And it shows my weapon points. Let me just open it just to be sure. Oh, it's actually the weapon points for my weapons. Actual weapons. So, I've got six. I'm going to have to do a quick range with my sticky bombs. That's three. And let's do another one with this one. Fast transformation. For both weapons, for now. And speaking of weapons, I don't have any. <clears throat> oh, I just missed all the um, armor. <laughs> let's see. That takes care of that. And I can't get over there. And neither over there, so... Let's just go to this area. And there's the doggy again. You can use the chainsaw before you run out of it. No doubt about it, of course. 
Looks like I'm already out as well. And I really need to work on that. Need to really upgrade, I'm trying to say. I'm too distracted. I can't go over there and jump just yet, so we'll come back to that later. But we finally got another page. The wolf. Mm, kind of looks like those Cerberus from Resident Evil. Oh well. We got what we need. Okay, looks like I can't go in there just yet. Which represent that. Which represents the thing that I'm trying to get. Just come back for it. And I need to watch out for these things. I don't think there's anything over there. There's another page. That's nice. So I'm gonna have to break this thing because there's something else over there. That's two. Just one more. And I fell off. We got it. First, let's read this. History of the Sentinel, Part 1. Okay. The Cosmic Spear. Mm -hmm. Secret of the Sword. I'm going to have to get to that real soon. Even though I'm not going to read all of it. Let's see. Kind of looks like the whole planet is being something coming out of the planet. Or a giant spear, which looks like a crystal, hitting that planet. And the hyperglitherates or something written down there kind of reminds me a lot like, like the Middle Earth. Alright, enough said. Let's just break this last chain. somehow release this which is me a golden version of me that is but it's actually the dash so whenever you're trying to get through hard places you can dash faster further or you can just dodge enemies attack like this And I need to be careful because I can't press dash any further because I'll just fall off. And there's something over there as well, so let's just... There we go. Another life. Looks like everything here is good, taken care of. Now let's see what's behind this door. Or I'm guessing that we're about to meet the king.
priests. You know our laws. Despite their transgressions against the Covenant, they are still of sentinel blood. What you interfere with now is bigger than you can imagine. It is written. It is their time to give penance. If you continue, you will bring down the Heaven's wrath. You are but one man. They are no longer your people to save. Yes, they are. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but the king kind of reminds me a lot like... I'm not sure who's the group from either Pandera, Pantera or some other group, I don't know. With the mole, maybe something. Now if you just turn around here, I'm guessing there's... Yes, I'm just what I thought. Another secret with an extra life. Thank you very much. Okay, based on this environment, becoming more Elder Scrawlish, and perhaps Lord of the Ring and Hobbit. King Novik, that's what his name is. There's his throne, so let's see. Or not. Now that we've gotten everything we need, let's go back and get that thing. The gate's open for me. Wait. wait. <gasps> no. It can't be. Could it be? My pet rabbit. Daisy! I thought I lost you forever. Oh well. Hmm. I guess you're all. Except I can't kill you. I'm sorry that I tried shooting you, Daisy. You will be remembered. Alright. Let's go back to this room and take care of business. Those things are already on, locked, so yeah, I won't be electrocuting myself. But fortunately, I'm just going to be careful. I'm going to have to use my plump blood punch real carefully. And I don't know how these guys aren't electrocuted. Thank you. Oh, okay. Looks like everything is taken care of. That was pretty weird. All these enemies are dead, just like that. Uh, 
Now that's taken care of. Let's try to go to this area. If you look carefully, there's something over there. So we've already gotten our dash. Let's head to that part. Okay, let's just try making this count first. And I messed up. That's okay, let's try it again. There we go. And it looks like we found this gore nest from the previous game. Let's see what this is about. Secret encounters. So it looks like I have a time limit based on my challenge or something. Let's try it out. Secret encounter complete. All right. So it looks like that takes care of them. of this environment. Looks like I've taken care of everything. Nothing there for me. So I'm going <clears> to <throat> I'm going to have to go over there to this portal thing and take it. This central battery can be used to provide additional power to your ship. Several modules remain unused. Finding more batteries will enable you to utilize the full functions of your command station. All right, like you said, sentinel batteries, that's what they are called. I keep forgetting. And from the looks of this, I don't think I can use my speed fast travel unless if it's already completed. So I guess I'm stuck here. Here goes nothing. Okay, so it looks like I've been teleported into this dimension now and we still have a lot of other secrets to find so let's go but we found a new weapon the plasma rifle classic looking one unlike the um, other one from the previous game and we have ourselves another enemy the revenant skeleton from the last one last game and it has the same exact explanation of how to destroy it. Weak spot. Oh yes, it also has all those stuff. Hints and tips. Just like all the others. Heavy. Ambil. Ambient, I'm trying to say. And fodders. So let's just take care of this. Let me get my thing. There we go. And let's try this back one out. Just to be sure. And that was pretty wasteful. It kind of feels a lot like the classic. Having that old version of the plasma rifle like this. Hmm. 
Let me see where all the action is. Oh, I guess there it is. Takes care of that. Let's see what else. And okay, nothing. But we found this giant hand looking thing pointing at this. Let me just check around here first. I can't break it, so I'm gonna have to find something to activate this giant arm laser cannon thing. And somehow I'm gonna be I'm gonna have to be careful in this part. Yeah. Yeah, based on these people, they seem like they've been slowly digested. Gotta be careful though. And I can't jump. Huh, this is pretty simple. simple. Alright, let's see what this map is. How big it is. And there must be some sort... Actually, there's a secret that I didn't check. But I can go around, back out. see what this bad boy has for me with the plasma rifle. Heat blast which returns and a new feature microwave beam. Okay so it looks like I'm gonna have to microwave our enemy but it looks like it takes a long time to, to finish these guys so I'm gonna have to use the good old heat blast for now. There is a sentinel power core nearby. You can use it to activate the mech and clear a path forward. Thank you, Vega. But first, I'm gonna have to check around here. Or just make a trick. Almost. Seven lives now. Let me see, just to be sure again. Nope. Okay, now we can go. And we found ourselves another battery. This thing. Actually, no, this is different. Never mind. Okay, now before we do that, let me just find the secret. That I was supposed to look around. Oh, there it is. Wonder what the secret is here. At Doom's Gate. 
the theme of the series. Nice. Looks like that's taken care of that. So I have five more to go. Okay, so place this here and let this arm do its work. Alright, that's good. I'll just check and see if there's anything I left around. Any ammo and whatever. Alright. I'm just gonna stick with my plasma rifle for now. Oh boy, this this area here is going to be interesting. Wrong button. Okay. Spider Doom, Spider Doom does whatever Spider Doom does. Can he rip? Can he tear? That's whatever Spider Doom does. Look out! Here comes the spider doom. Okay, enough joke around. Let's see. <clears throat> I don't see anything else here. <laughs> Looks like I'm going back. Oh, great. Actually, I can... Oh, there it is. Up here. History of the Sentinel Part 2. Mm -hmm. So, like I said before, you can feel free to pause and read it if you want. But... Story isn't everything in the universe of Doom. And looks like some of these gods and most of these gods are either the hell priests worshipping these angel-like entities, which is the maker, con maker. I'm having a very hard time to pull my grip when I'm saying something. Must have drink something. Too much caffeine or water, doesn't matter. Something down there. I'm just gonna take care of this first. One. And down there's two. Oh, something over there, okay. A secret, nice. That takes care of that. Or I can just go over there instead. Welcome to hell. 
Back to hell, actually. And we got ourselves another mech. Looks like somehow... Angel versus Demon. War between heaven and hell. Unless I'm trying to assume that... Heaven is trying to... Join side with hell. That wouldn't be good. Okay, but what thing's good is... Perfect target. Nice. Alright, time to have some fun. Of course, this guy. Revenant. Revy, as I like to put it. guys now. Oh, looks like that heal blast thing managed to work out. What was that about? I don't know. I gotta change my shotgun. And I'm dead. Never mind.
Okay, that takes care of that. Sorry for the long silence. I was having a hard time with those noises in the background and all. But I'm pretty sure there are more of these things roaming around here. Or not. So, yeah, that takes care of that. Alright, that's a pretty loud now noise. <coughs> I have been doing my dashing all. And there's um, all of that stuff here and there. Okay, looks like there's something pointing over there, so I'm gonna have to find out what it is. Let me help you out. And there are more of these things. Oh, actually more items here. I don't know how I should get over there, but we'll have to go. Take care of that first. Dash refill, okay. So there's little things hanging in there, the yellow things. They refill the dash, so I'm gonna have to make my way. And I messed up. No, I didn't, okay, so. Oh, yes, I did, so. I was too distracted by this mech falling down. Got it, just to be sure. Alright, we found another one of these battery things, so now we can... Hold that thought. How could I... How is that even possible? I just... Oh my god. Alright, so it looks like that's another life lost. Holy moly, I am out of focus. Am I supposed to go over here? I don't think so. Oh, there's something over there, so let's just put in this thing first. Another Gorness. There we go. Cuss Bluey. Ugh. Gooey. And I believe this is one of those crucible energy for the Argent. Whatever. Powered by this giant mech. Let's just go back here first and... Of course, there's a secret found, yes. And see what kind of challenge this can offer me. Lost souls. Well, that was easy. 
And it's been a while since I've seen these lost souls around. Of course I am having my doubts that I'll be... Okay, that was terrible. I was trying to get up to there. Get that energy. I mean, the armor. Maybe I'm not using the dash more often than I'm supposed to. I'm gonna have to go up there and find my way. I'm gonna have to make a leap of faith just to get it. Oh, I sort of did, but I'm gonna have to go back again to this area now. Just checking around. Into the belly of the beast. Ugh. Too much boils and cysts here and there. <laughs> Does not look like a pretty picture. Yep. I'm pretty sure I should feel, I should feel sorry for these people being digested slowly. Horribly. Okay, well, I don't know what's wrong with him. Damn it! You know what? I should have my plasma. Okay, that actually worked. There, at least I got my armor back. Nothing over there, solids. Yeah, try to shoot me away. And I can't jump, so I'm gonna have to circle the best I can quickly. Looks like I locked, unlocked another weapon thing. All right, let's see. Plasma, that'll work. <sighs> of course I got you to deal with. Takes care of him. More of these tentacles are hiding under these tar. Clear. You 
You know, let me check something around here. Must be missing something. Alright, I'm gonna have to go someplace in this area. Just as I thought, I gotta climb around, walk around this part. There we go. Okay, another one. Another one of these batteries, I'm trying to say. Now let me place this one here and see... This thing. Blasting through that Titan guy. Looks like I found another one of those sentinel upgrade things. Sentinel crystals, I meant. Not this time, bitch. Alright, so it looks like I'm gonna have to upgrade my what? Ammo. I'm trying to say. <clears throat> I really cannot talk right now. Ammo already upgraded, so thank you. At least I won't have any problems getting more. What's going on here? Okay, so it looks like this part wants me to be more... Take a platformer approach. Let me just take care of this guy. Just shooting too much. There we go. Let's see. Just three more secrets to go and something over there. Oh, that's right. Let me see my challenge. And another thing dropped on my lap. I can't push him off, so... Well, I found this. History of the Sentinel, Part 3. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hold up, just to miss something. Alright, let me see the picture now. So, that must be the fortress that I'm in. Or hanging around. Shooting up in the air through space. And I'm guessing that one of my thing has survived. Okay. Now let's see what this platinum thing is about that the zombie fell into. And I messed up.
No oh, great. I'm dead again. something. Hit these guys with a perfect shot. Once they're in the air. Let me try this again. There we go. Looks like I found a key to something. Slayer key. And I'm guessing this is the one I'm supposed to go. Slayer gate. So I have the Slayer key I found, so let's check this bad boy out. Let me just put this here and turn it. And I found another gore nest. Okay. Now I heard this challenge is pretty difficult, so we're going to try our best to do it. I'm probably not going to show the whole thing for the others probably edit it but you know yeah so let's try this out here we go okay this is getting pretty tense my plasma rifle. gargoyles in this area. I don't know, but this part here, especially the background, kind of reminds me a lot like... It's a mod from the old Doom games right now. I think it's called Evanationary or something. I can't pronounce it right. Got another enemy here. And I'm dead. Holy crap, I gotta watch out. I'm almost dead. I'm already dead again. This is pretty bad. Oh my god, this is no joke. And this is my last life. Dread Knights, that's what they're called. Man, 
and I'm already dead. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm already aware of that. Alright, so that was pretty much of a challenge of this trial. The Slayer Gate is no joke, so I'm gonna have to try this again, see if this turn out better, despite of me losing all my lives. That was a bit disappointing. And that is a done deal. Oh my god. And looks like I got a key. That trial thing was no joke. <laughs> I thought I died almost. I already died more than enough and I've wasted all my life. But I got myself an Empyrean key. That's good. And pretty hard as hell. No freaking joke, no doubt about it. Let me see. I got three, two more secrets to go. Before I can get out of here. Oh my god.
This way or that way? Decisions, decisions? Actually, this way. There we go. There we go. Wait for it. No! Eh, at least I got my life back. The betrayer's life signal is nearby. Okay, whoever this betrayer is, we're gonna have to see him. And I should have checked over there first. Yep, messed up. Let's see what's over here. Nothing. Okay. That was a waste of time. Now let's see this betrayal person. There are motion sensors and artillery everywhere. I told you all to leave me here. I am where I belong. Saving your people will not bring you peace. Only make the burden you carry worse. And now you seek to defy the con maker herself. It is your people's time now to give penance. Just as it was mine. Hear me, Slayer. When his heart is laid to rest, then his soul will be at peace. And so will mine. Okay. Thanks, I guess. So this must be the betrayer. Kind of reminds me of... One of the characters from Gears of War. See what it's over here. Nothing. Okay, I can't shoot you, so... Yeah. Let me see. There's two more things over there, so... Let me check around here. Nope, nothing. Thank you so much, Mr. Whoever you are, Betrayer. Oh, wait a minute, let me just check one more thing. Is your ascent crucible hammer? Is that yours? Nice, I didn't know. Samuel, Samuel Hayden, the guy that I met in my previous game, has exactly like that, but a sword and all that. <coughs> the Betrayer. Does look like a character from Gears of War. Okay. And is one of the Night Sentinel. Him and his crucible hammer. Now let me see that final secret. It's back there, alright? Uh. Oh, there it is. If I could find it.
I guess down it is. Or could I just jump over there? There it is. A Kaggle Demon toy. Looks like a giant meatball. Or a tomato. Alright. Looks like that's everything, so... On my way. To wherever I'm, wherever I'm going. <clears throat> that looks like that's everything. point has been identified. I will mark its location on your HUD. Yes, thank you. And looks like I found another life over there. I'm not sure how to get through it. I could just wait for this thing to fall and head back. That was a close one. Now I got my lives back. Despite losing a few during that trial thing. That was pretty hard. Now I'm gonna have to go back and forth. I'm trying to be more... Super Mario-ish. And look what I found. A quad damage. Nice. That's cool. I can see my own reflection. And I'm getting to that point. Shotgun now. First, let me get one of those ammo. <clears throat> I'm beginning to mumble now. Great. I've already lost my life now. Thanks a lot, guys.
And that takes care of that. So, looks like I've gotten everything. And I'm going to try to fix my weapon, upgrade them in some sort. Nine, so that's... Let me just upgrade the smallest part first before we can continue on. Mm. There we go. No, oh, wrong button. And we're done. So that takes care of everything. So let's go home. That's done. And the combat is done. And my exploration. That's also a done deal. Nice. There. there we go. So that takes care of everything. And I'm gonna have to stop this video now. Despite some challenges and comments that I have lately, so. I'll try better next time. But thank you again for watching my video. And once again, I do hope you leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. And make sure that you stay safe. And I said before in my last video, wash your hands, practice your social distance, etc. And you'll be fine. So until then, I will see you again in the next video.